Find the coordinates of the circle center of triangle ABC with vertices A3, 0, B, negative 1, negative 6, and C, 4, comma, negative 1. Now, circle center is a point uh, which is equidistant from all the three vertices, or is a point from which you can draw a circle which passes through all the three vertices. So let me so I've drawn a diagram. This is not drawn, this are, these are arbitrary points, not according to the exact uh, coordinates. So A is 3, 0, B is negative 1, negative 6, and 4 is, sorry, C is 4, comma negative 1. P is the circumcenter. Okay, now P doesn't necessarily be inside. It can be inside, it can be outside, or it can be also on the triangle. Now this is an acute angle triangle. And in an acute angle triangle, the circumcenter is inside the triangle. So P is a circumcenter, so it is at the same distance from all the three vertex. Okay, so that is P A is equal to P B is equal to P C, which is also called the circumradius. This is also called the circumradius. Okay, if you want to find if the question was also find the circumradius. Uh, you can, once you find x and y, you can find the circumradius. That is not difficult. So here, yeah, again, the same principle, p a squared is equal to p b squared. So using the distance formula, I can write x minus 3 squared plus y minus 0 squared is equal to x, take away negative 1, which is x plus 1 squared, uh, plus y take away negative 6 is y plus 6 squared. So I want you to look at this step. Uh, hopefully you can understand that. It's a simple expansion of this. Okay, I'm not reading the steps. So what happens is this and this gets canceled, this and this gets canceled. So what remains is uh, this. And then simplifying this, you get, if you take away minus 2x from this side, you have to take away minus 2x from this side. And if you take away 12y from this side, you have to take 12y from this side. And if you take away 9 from this side, you have to take away 9 from this side. And that's how I got this. And dividing by 4, you get minus 2x minus 3y is equal to 7. And multiplying by negative 1, you get this result. Okay. The same way you can say PA is equal to, PA squared is equal to PC squared. So PA would be uh, the same thing. P A squared would be the same thing. So I hope you understand this. Uh, so I've done the steps to save time. And again, you can understand this cancellation of x squared, y squared with x squared, y squared on both sides. So this simplifies to this. I want you to look at the steps. The steps are very clear. So this is equation 1. 2x plus 3y is equal to negative 7. That was equation 1. So trying to solve this, I have multiplied this with the second, the first equation, uh, sorry, the second equation with negative 2. Okay, to cancel this, negative 2x and 2x. So this is nothing but equation 1. So this is if you're multiplying by negative 2, 2x two will become minus 2x, minus y will become plus 2y, and 4 will become minus 8. Okay, so 5y is negative 15, so y is negative 3. Okay, so that means we know x is, what is x? x, if you make x the subject here, x can be written as uh, 4 plus y, so 4 plus negative 3 is 1. So the circumcenter is 1 comma negative 3. Now you can check yourself. Try to, you know the coordinates uh, A, A, B, and C, and C. Check whether AP is equal to BP is equal to CP.